Hey guys, Brian here from 2B Clean Auto Detailing out in Northeast Ohio. Today I wanted to do a video about all-in-ones and what are they and what are the benefits and why you as a client or you as the detailer would want to use them. So here's a car that's been sort of neglected. It hasn't been washed a lot. It's, it's about 10 years old. Uh, the paint's kind of damaged. And uh, I wanted to show you four different ways you could do an all-in-one with HD Speed, which is a wax base. Uh, then we have Black Fire, which is a sealant base. And we have VPC Flash, which is an acrylic base and it's a compound. And then we have Angel Wax Enigma all-in-one, which is a medium cut compound and a ceramic base. And uh, on the wax and sealant, I have a foam pad, medium cut. And on the inside, I'm gonna use a Eurofiber microfiber pad. I know that all, both, all four of these will finish down nicely on this paint. So first what I want to say is the reason why you as a client would want to have an all-in-one is because if your paint is kind of old and faded and it needs a little rejuvenation of shine and gloss, this is an easy way and a less expensive version of a, a one-stage polish, which takes longer to do because you need to do four or five passes because you need to break down the polish or compound. But with the all-in-one, it has minor abrasives in it, and it allows the detailer to lightly buff the area and then leave protection, get you in and out the door quickly. Uh, but again, a one-stage polish, the detailer would need to make several more passes to make sure you finish down correctly. Then you need to remove all those oils and then apply your protection. So that's why an all-in-one could be a great fit for you as a client and a detailer. So if you come on in, I'm going to show you what the paint looks like. Hopefully it'll pick it up, but you can see in the sun how scratched up it is. Hopefully we'll keep this to be able to view for the rest of the video. I'm going to do a quick little demo on how to use these all-in-ones. So for the detailer, I'm going to use just the machine's pressure. I'm going to do two, maybe probably three light passes. So it's going to be real quick. You're going to just exfoliate the clear coat, get to get that dullness gone, and ramp up shine and gloss. The swirls may be left a lot more with the HD speed, which is wax, and then again the black fire, which is the sealant. I'm going to work the middle panels a little longer because it's got a compound, and I want to make sure I use the compound up. And you also want to be careful when you use all of these because the more you do work the product down, the more heat, the more friction, the more the wax is going to dissipate, the sealant's going to go, the ceramic base, and the acrylic as well. So I'm going to start with this HD Speed, which is kind of like a staple in the detailing industry. Uh, there's a lot more other products now that are all in ones. There's the DTC Flash Pro, which is the cut compound. They also have a, a synthetic one as well, like the black fire version. I've already washed, clayed, and panel wiped the hood. So I'm going to try to get this demo quickly. So I don't bore you guys to death. And again, I'm going to just do light passes.
this stuff wipes off really easy. So we can let it sit there for a minute. I'm gonna let that sit up for a second. I'm gonna go ahead and here's uh, the black fire one. Sorry, I had to get a new pad. It fell. So here's the black fire, same thing. Light passes, two to three passes. I'm only doing light pressure, basically the machine weight, only for you guys out there that are wanting to get into polishing. All the ones are great to learn how to handle the machine, you know, the speeds, how to clean your pads and all that without kind of damaging your clear coat by over polishing. And then also you guys can learn how how heavy do you want to press? You know, maybe your machine will stall out. Maybe you'll buff the paint too much and you just, you can ease off of the pressure. So that's why I'm just doing super light pressure. I mean, you guys can take it from there, figure out how much you want to put on there because you can get a little more cut out of it, a little more pressure. But this is just to show you the basics. Let that sit up. I'm going to go ahead and buff off the wax one. HD speed. And then for these next two, since they're uh, a compound instead of a polish, you need to work it a little longer. So I'm going to probably do four light passes. But again, you can play with it, see how much you want to do. It's all about the budget. How much is the? How much does the plant want? Do you want as a client to be removed? Do you want to just make it shiny? You can make that happen a lot faster. Using HD speed, it's super slick. So I'm gonna let that sit up. And I'm gonna go ahead and work Enigma all in one. The medium cut compound with a ceramic base. shook all these up. This might be a little bit low, larger area than you normally would polish, but for the sake of the video we're just going to do it. that compound is spread out really good so that all the abrasives are spread out. The other ones are just waxes and sealing with hardly any abrasives.
just wanted to keep it there. I felt like three was enough. I slowed my speed down. That way I could get a little the same essence and a little more cut to it. Now since this is a ceramic base, I do want to mention that HD Speed and the Blackfire waxes and sealants ones, they're super easy to wipe off. You can even have them in direct sunlight. Uh, what we call a Flash Pro, uh, they have a flash by itself, we call that Junior Flash. And um, you could use that in direct sunlight. However, this Flash Pro and Enigma wouldn't recommend putting it in uh, sunlight. It would be hard to work with. You don't want it to flash as you're working. I'm in the shade, it's 75 degrees, so that's perfect. So I'm going to let this sit on the panel. It's a little bit longer as you let it set up, the easier it's going to be to wipe off. I'm going to go ahead and remove this black fire sealant. Both of them nice and smooth. I believe the HD speed is a little smoother. This isn't really a, a demo on what product is better, because they're all different. If you're mobile, like I am, HD Speed gets the job done. Flash, uh, Flash Junior, Baby Flash, that gets the job done. Uh, if you want a little bit more cut and the customer, the client wants a little bit more removed, Flash Pro and Enigma All in One are, are good options. And uh, the protection you get from a wax would be two months. The sealants, you know, I'll say in Ohio, probably three to four. And then the acrylic, that's going to be four or five six months and then the ceramic is two to three so again it's like what do you want to offer your customer do you want to offer them uh longer protection do you want to just is it a dealership you just want to buff the car up make it look shiny gloss um so that's why i'm just showing the different versions of them So the, uh, the Enigma All-in-One has a little bit of time to set up, so I'm going to wipe, wipe it off. And again, if you let it sit a little longer, which is why you don't want to be in direct sunlight, it wipes off just fine. Nice and smooth finish. It provides a lot of gloss. Definitely, they all do. But I really like that Enigma as well. I'm going to go ahead and buff this off as well. 
for the video sake. This wipes off like this heavy cut or the medium cut compound with the acrylic. This wipes off like almost like HD speed, which is amazing. So I'll try to get the sun set so you guys can see what they all did to it. I'm going to go ahead and bring you in here. And so this HD speed here, you know, it's got what they call fillers. It's really got wax. So the wax is a filler. It fills the cracks of the clear coat. Of course, it doesn't want to play nice with me right now. Uh, there's probably a little bit of swirling still. So here's the HD speed side. You can see that there's still some swirls left, obviously. And then here's the little tape line. Tape line. Enigma all in one. Less swirls. And then we're going to take you to the DPC Flash Pro. See if we can get that in there. A little less swirls than the Enigma. Here's the tape line, so you can see the difference. So it definitely removed a lot of defects. And then here's the black fire. Just like the HD speed side, excuse me, has swirls left. However, the gloss, it definitely all these products make it pop. Okay guys, I hope you guys like this little demo here. Um, I hope it gave you some ideas as a customer on what you could get out of your car that won't break the bank. And I hope as a new detailer out there that it can give you motivation to use any of those products uh, with the right pad selection and just to get used to the machine and basically you know, work your way into learning how to do one-step polishes. Um, so I hope you enjoyed that video, and I'll put uh, links in the description below uh, for all those products in case you wanted to check them out. This is not for, you know, this is not advertisement to to push any of these products. They all work really well. So um, just wanted to give you quick little links so that you can click them and check them out. So thank you for watching. I hope you like and subscribe to this channel. And thank you so much.